What's good guys? Welcome back to Lyomar TV Mark here with another exciting, delighting, and much interesting video. So this is actually a beautiful news as yes, on the 26th of this month, on the 26th of February, ABA will be getting 24 power supply uh, as a geometric power plant is about to be commissioned or uh, on that fateful day in the city of ABA. I'll first of all say a special thank you to Governor Alex Choma Oti because other past administration in Abia State have not look into all of this project but since the governor came in he has been trying very very much to ensure that all of these things are put in place for the good people of not just Abba but also Abia state and now this is going to boost the economic growth of the state you know bringing in more investors businesses are going to stabilize a lot of people will have jobs and yes money will flow the economy at least for that side will go well well, I'm just going to read this out for you guys as is coming from this day, the business day um, newspaper. It said the 181 megawatt geometric power plant in the Osisioma industrial layout of Aba in Abia State will be commissioned on Monday, February 26, 2024 to a statement by the company's management issued just now. The plan was originally scheduled for inauguration on Saturday, February 24, by President Bola Tinubu. The new date was chosen by the presidency in Abuja due to what insider sources describe as unexpected development. The president will commission the 181 MW Tamal plant alongside Aba Power Limited, which will take electricity from the new plant and supply to the nine of the 17 local government areas in Abia. Reacting to this de to the decision to postpone the long-awaited commissioning on Monday, an energy consultant in Lagos engineer Cliff Ene, who was a senior manager with the default National Electricity Power of Nigeria, NEPA, after serving as a senior engineer with the Texa Power and Light Corporation in the United States, said this morning, a 48 our difference is not significant. He continued by saying that we are proud of the support of the federal government has of late been given to the geometric power integration integrated company in the the only group in Nigeria that will generate and distribute its own power. Other power firm either generate or distribute, but do not get involved in both described as the biggest investment in the southeast geometric has spent some 800 million dollars on its integrated power project which includes building a 27 kilometer natural gas pipeline from owaza in okwa west lga in abia state to osisoma industrial layout in aba he continued by saying, we have, in addition, installed a 150 kilometer of cables and wire and installed four new power substations as well as refurbished three other inherited from the default power holding company of Nigeria. Explained Ben Kavin, a former NEPA executive director, famous for leading transmission, generation and engineering division, stimulus simulating in the former state owned by own power utility. Calvin is now the managing director of Geometric Power Limited. Patrick Kume, a former executive with the Lux Angel Water and Light in the United States, who later served as a commissioner in charge of markets, market rates and competition at the Nigerian Electricity and Regulatory Commission, NAC, described the tubular poles mounted by geometric power in a bar and in everyone as incomparable in Africa, which is like one of the best. Only in cities like Tokyo and San Francisco in California, you have facilities of this quality and size. I think so, I think at this point now they are trying to overhype it. Anyway, I've not been to a bar for quite a long time now. So let me not, let me just read it out. At least maybe one of any day from now, I'll just pay a visit and see truly how this thing is going. Let's continue. Say, much as they are very tall 
as all of us can see the tumbular poles here are actually about 10 meters deep in other words it's in the unlikely event of a natural disaster like earthquake in aba or it environ aba power and the geometry group will still be able to supply electricity to numerous customers the geometric power group was founded by professor bat naji a global respected academic engineer in the united states who has been in nigeria's minister of science and technology and later minister of power Naji embarked on the integrated project after then world bank president james wolfson and the Niger and then the nigerian finance minister ngozi okojoewela visited aba on march 17 2004 and discovered that the greatest challenge facing both large scales and medium scale industrialists in aba reputed to be the center of indigenous manufacturing in nigeria is epileptic power supply well when it comes to power supply i am going to say yes aba suffer a lot in terms of power supply and up to now they are still suffering it so this is like going to be like one of the best projects they can ever have if it comes to pass if on the 26th of february this coming month that power plant is commissioned and takes effect it, now one thing about nigerian things is it's not just about commissioning this power plant it's about commissioning the power plant and ensuring that it takes effect immediately i know a lot of projects that have been commissioned that are not functioning number one of those projects is the Abakliki International Airport. That airport was commissioned under the Umai administration. Few months later, we heard that the runways are not working. Anyway, let's continue with this um, one. Both Wolfson and Okonjo Iwela appealed to Naji to assist with a power plant dedicated to Abak. Following the 22MW Abuja Emergency Power Plant, he led a team of Nigeria engineers to build in Niger in Abuja from 2000 to 2001 that supplied uninterrupted power to critical places like the Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation Company, the Central Bank Headquarters, the Asho Rock, and the entire Central Business District Abuja. The electricity city was really available in Aba, noted Chief Alpha Alphos Udenibo Ude Ibo, President General of 22 members Aba Landlord Protection and Development Association and when it was available, it was so poor that it could not power your household appliances, let alone industrial machines. The inauguration of the geometric power, power next Monday, according to Sir Alexander Madu Ko, President of Association of Aba Industrial, Industrialists will mark a new dawn in the country not just in aba abia state well for me i'll say a big congratulation to the good people of aba like i said earlier this is not it just it's not just about commissioning this power plant it's about ensuring that it takes effect immediately that is what i am saying anyway drop a comment below let's get, get to hear your thoughts what do you think about this one for me i'll say it's a congratulation to the good people of abia states a big one a big win for aba and eat environment. Thank you for watching this video.